Jono, I really like your presentation. Very modern and unlike any fish and chip dish that I've had. The lobster is beautifully cooked. This is a really lovely lobster dish. At just 25, Essex-based Alex has already had nine years' experience working at kitchens in the UK and Europe. He's now head chef at the local restaurant where he started his career as a pot wash. I had a good start, good, really good comments. I think I impressed the judges with the classical kind of cooking. Uh, that is kind of me, so that's the way I've learned. Um, but I like to kind of put modern twists on it. Um, but there's loads more to show. Alex, seafood, what does that mean to you? Uh, for me, it means like Norfolk. I used to go to the Norfolk as a child a lot, like nan and granddad and family. So I'm based on that a little bit. So I've chosen the hake. Uh, and then I'm doing like a mussel and cream sauce with some caviar to go through the end and some chives. Then I've got some sea herbs. And then I've just got a few kind of little crispy elements. The coast is all about you, grand and granddad, yeah. some fish and chips, uh, and great memories. Go for a nice room at the end. Alex, we'll let you crack on. Thank you very much. Hake, crispy new potatoes, got a mussel sauce with some sea herbs running through it. He's going to finish the sauce with a touch of caviar and chives. Pickled cucumber on the dish as well. Sea herbs, you know, they don't even need to, to be cooked, and if they do, it's got to be done very quickly. There's nowhere to hide with this dish. It's got to look good, taste good, and it's got to be executed to perfection. Chefs, we've got eight minutes left. Eight minutes. Last finishing touches. That's it, guys. Time's up. Finished. First up is Jono, who's made his take on fish and chips poached lobster with deep-fried vinegar scraps, crispy spiralized potatoes, fresh peas, and finish with a tartare and curry sauce. Jono, I really like your presentation. Very modern and unlike any fish and chip dish that I've had. The lobster is beautifully cooked. This is a really lovely lobster dish. They've got the curry running through that sauce. It's not until I have the vinegar scraps and a bit of the, the crisps from the potatoes, I can then relate it to fish and chips. It's fun, but it's delicious. I think you've nailed it. Great job there, Jono. Thank you very much, Monica. The tartar sauce elements of the dish and the curry sauce flavours, looking at the plate of food, I didn't think I would find them, but they are there. They're sitting underneath this dish, bringing a lovely little twist. It's a twist that's not visual, and it's a twist that is unexpected, which I think is absolutely a really clever thing to do. The peas are great. The lobster is beautifully cooked. Love the little crispy potatoes. That's great. That represents the chips, but I just love the scraps. The scraps with the vinegar, sensational. It's a refined piece of work touching all of the right notes. Very, very good indeed, Jono. Over the moon, ecstatic. Yeah, the comments were amazing. As soon as they said seaside, I was like, boom, I know what I'm doing. Straight away, fish and chips. And uh, absolutely smashed it. <laughs>